Hello, hello, hello. Can everybody hear me? It's Friday night. We're live. We should just, it should just start. Should just begin. I just click this button. Bam, we're already here, baby. Let's see. I need to adjust a little things, or, but we, you can hear me. Things are looking fine. Getting a little blur on my end, but hey, that's okay. We'll figure it out. Just beginning. It's pretty up the scene here. I can't even reach that one. Whatever. I don't like, man, them lights, the Christmas, I'm trying to get in the spirit. But these lights, look at that. Look at, look how bright those are. They're just going to have to go. These up here are just going to have to do, guys. Much better. That's better. I mean, they're there. These, these are right above me. That's, you know, that's good enough, right? That's good enough. All right, I got a new, once again, I'm, you know, I'm always setting stuff up. Um, but I now have the chat right in my streaming software, so I can, I should be able to see you guys much easier. I was frantically uh, getting it set up while waiting. I, of course, I wait to the last minute to try and fix this, but. You guys come in early. Tim Evans, Will Henderson, Ron's Wood Turning Shop, and stuff. D freaking C, the legend himself. Legend. DC, let's just, everyone just take a moment to say, DC, we love you. I love you. I appreciate you. You're the man. DC. I'm going to get your name just tattooed. DC. I'm going to do it. Michelle Lynn, Mark Bond, Brett Marquart. Hope I said, I never know how to say that. Brett M., what's up, brother? <laughs> Julie, the freaking legend, also sent, uh, she sent some samples, which will be coming up um, in, some, in some future live episodes, but she also sent this incredible cape, which, you know, my patrons, I threatened you to be here. So, if you saw the lens, I'm sure that's the only reason why you're here, <laughs> is the cape and the, and, the, and the little eyepiece. Which, the eyepiece, while we're shouting people out, friggin' DC the Legend, Julie the Legend, and Scary Beeper sent... Oh, you can't see it that good on the thing. Let's see. Scary Peeper sent a holiday peeper. Who is now wearing the mask that Julie also sent me? So, <laughs> scary peeper. Now, now we have a holiday peeper in the house. That's what do we do? We're always peeping, peeping and creeping. Gary Franchi said that I sent him. I don't know where I sent. Oh, I did send you. See, I threatened you to be here. Ryan Tarpy, Donnie the Linux Cat, Donnie. He's the the one who sent tonight's flight that we're doing. So that's going to be fun. It's the theme of tonight's um, blind is called wild, like wild stuff. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to think. He told me that it's not intentionally bad. Like he's not, he didn't send me just terrible things, but I'm guessing they're just going to be weird and wild bourbons. I don't know. I don't even know if they're all bourbon. I just know they're weird. So, I don't know. Kind of nervous. Kevin Campbell. What's up, buddy? Who else we got in here? I know there's more. Everyone flowing in here. Let me scroll down. I'm, I'm up in the pregame squad now. Mike Meyer. Jeffrey Rollins. Roy R. Does Things. Sugar Friggin' Kitty. Biggin sent him. He was in the... Oh, he, is, he still is in the co-pilot seat. So, he's right next to me. Still working on the Biggin cam. Mike Franklin. Who else? We got Barn Friggin' Door. One of his accounts. <laughs> Let's see. Who else? Kilco. What's up, buddy? Edward Thomas. All right. I don't want to miss anyone. Here we go. Now, see, now we're catching up to like the actual chat. Spencer Mav. Hey there. Mother Superior. Did you used to talk about how buff you were and how you always. Lifted weights? I'm not seeing it. No. I never, I never lift weights. I don't work out. Uh, it wasn't me. 
Chris Buzalencia. DC. There we go. There's the DC love. Jerry Black. Sir Daniel Friggin Kerber. JG. Cool 62 Chev. Scott Post. Richie Z. Bev Friggin Porter's lurking. ADHD. Look at that. The legends are just flowing in here. ADHD Friggin was the Austin Feltz. Another legend? Are you kidding me? How do I have so many legends in here? Peter White? Tom Flanagan made it. All right, let's get some. Let, let, let's get some. Let's get some drinks. You know that that parched me reading all of your names as you keep flowing in here. Everyone, get something in your glass. Just, just anything. It doesn't even matter what it is. Just drink something. That's that's what tonight's about. We're pre-gaming for the legend himself, the best, the world's top whiskey taster, Matt Friggin Porter. Ooh, yeah, that's delicious. That's good. Which is just some... Just some good old old Forrester. To warm the palate up. To get me in the zone. To destroy this flight. And to make terrible guesses about the things Donnie sent me. I know I'm never going to have... Just, he told me. He said, I'm pretty sure you've never had these. And you might not like some of them. How do, what do you... What do you what do you get from that? What do you, how do I take that? It's probably going to be terrible stuff. I don't know. I'm kind of nervous. So how's everyone doing? Mike Baker lurking from the Great Northwest. Bourbon Bites. What's up, Clifton? Joining the fun? Can't ban Hammer Kerber tonight. You're safe here, brother. <laughs> for now. You're safe for now. Oh goodness gracious! I'm just yeah. Let's just let's kind of warm up, man, before we get into this flight. I'm sure, Donnie will give the rules um, as we kind of go. So before we get started, we're we're gonna do something. We're gonna do something different tonight, guys. We're gonna we're gonna do something a little different. So it it, it just bear with me, as I'm gonna have to explain this. I've been working on it. The there's there's a giveaway. There's giveaways tonight. Big and wants in on it. He's already saying, hey. What's up, Wesley? Just in time to hear E.T. phone home. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome, E.T. Okay, so tonight's giveaway. So, there's two parts to this thing, okay? Two friggin' parts. Part one. So, all, every $5 Super Chat gets you entered into two different lists, okay? Are you, are you tracking me? I'm going to just, plain and simple, you get entered into two lists. List one will be given away tonight. List two, we're going to do this like, you know, this week, next week, and maybe the week after. So like a month, just a December giveaway. The winner tonight gets a chance to spin the whiskey wheel. The wheel will decide your reward, okay? So there's that. <laughs> that's that's tonight's thing. So every, in you know, depending on how successful this is, we'll probably we might spin the wheel multiple times. But you get to spin the wheel, which I will show you later. It pops up right here, and we're gonna spin the friggin' wheel. It pops up. Okay. There's reward like you know just simple stuff. You got sample rewards. You got sample and cigar rewards. You got two sample. In cigar, you got three sample, you got a whiskey flight, you got spin again, you got, what's that? What did I hear? You got a bottle on there. It, you know, there's no telling. So, okay. Um, Matt, I just got your message. I'll get back to you. <laughs> um, so that's part one. So you get to spin the wheel. Part two is a month, is at the end of the month, we'll do a giveaway. You're entered into it automatically, even if you don't win the wheel, right? And that's going to be for a bottle, Donnie, Eagle Rare store pick, okay? So you're entered into both. So you'll, you know, are you following me? Does this make sense, everyone? 
and depending on how well it goes, at the end of the month, we'll freaking do multiple. I'll add multiple bottles in the giveaway. But the Eagle Rare store pick is the is the one I want to give away. Um, the winner of the wheel. So just to make it, just to sweeten the deal a little bit, if you win tonight's thing and you get to spin the wheel, then you uh you get an extra entry into the thing. I know it sounds confusing. I got it all. Just know you're entered into both. Sherry G <laughs> donated 10 bucks. She's in there twice. She's on both things, right? So she's on tonight's list. She's on the monthly list. Man, simple as that. Simple as that. If you win the when you spin the wheel, you just get you get to not you get the reward you land on. And you get an additional entry to the month. Bam. That's how we're doing it. Make it a little more engaging. That's how we're going to do it. In the in the thing, if Donnie or DC or someone wants to drop the little link that shows you to where Sherry did it, there you go. You'll pop up on the screen. Everyone will see you. Ooh, now that that's out of the way, that was a lot. I've been thinking about like how I'm gonna do this because it's just it seems confusing, but I have it figured out. It's gonna be fun. That way, you know, I wanted it to be a little um like engaging in the sense of like um even though if you don't win tonight, you're still in a you're still on a list. It'll be a much grander list because it's gonna be from this week and next week and whatever, but bam. Anonymous! And I might that might be Ron's wood turning shop and stuff because he said figured it out sent <laughs> that might be him. And it's so much easier now with this new layout. I can see everyone. It just pops everyone up who super chats tonight, so it's right there. Even if I miss it, I see it. Let's start pouring these out because. Whatever the heck they are, I know they're going to need need some time to air out. Donnie, this is the wild stuff, okay? This is the one we're doing. We're doing the weird stuff. Which, tell me, Do Donnie, this wild stuff flight that we're doing, are they, are these all bourbons or can they be anything? Like, is there scotch in here? Is there is there scotch in this? Yep, okay, Donnie, so anonymous was Ron's wood turning shop. I'll remember that. I, that's what I do. Mike Meyer wants to know where he can buy the wrench Kinsey glass. So right now they are only so this first run is is out for it's going to be going to certain tiers of Patreons first. Um, it was pretty easy ordering them and stuff, so I might, you know, I'm going to look at ways of being able to, you know, get them out to more people and whatnot, but I don't know. I want to, you know, I want to, I want the Patreon glass to be different than something I would sell to people, just so it's like you get the special glass, so Maybe I'll do something different, but yeah, this glass is pretty friggin' sweet. Maybe I'll change it. Maybe I'll use a different logo or a different iteration of the logo so the Patreons get this one and I don't know. We'll work it out. Something's gonna happen, guys. Daniel Kerber, he's in. Wait, so your message didn't pop up. I see it now, so Sherry... Said, ready for a fun night. Daniel, my pop may pop back in later, but have fun, ha have to run for now. Cheers, Trevor. Cheers, buddy. I don't know why the friggin' thing's not popping up. The message. It's fine. It's fine, guys. Amy Bohm, the legend's in here. What's up? Still only 14 likes. Guys, what are you doing? Okay, so real quick, I'm going to pull this up. 
Okay. Z-Man's in here. Uh, Donnie the Linux Cat said, no scotch? Thank goodness. DC, please be scotch. So it's whiskey. It can be just flavored whisk flavored whiskeys for all I know. Oh no. No, please. I don't know. He said it says wild. I'm imagining it's probably going to be some pretty weird stuff. Yeah, Sherry, I don't know what the heck. I see it on my end, like on my little thing there, but I don't know why it didn't pop up. Obviously, something messed up, but that's fine. Eddie, thanks for all you do. Well, you're in, Eddie. See, man, I, I want y'all stuff to pop up. What is going on? Let me see if I can't finagle. You guys just stay right there. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess with something. You're getting some behind the scenes action. It would be, looks like right chia. Bam, okay. Whoop, that's not it. Let's see. I, I just want your messages to pop up. Like, why are they not popping up? When I tested it, it totally popped up. And y'all are super chatting right now, getting in on this double giveaway. Tim Evans is in. I know I know it was a bit confusing, but we got it. We figured it out. So it's two. So it's the spin the wheel tonight, and at the end of the month, we're going to do the whole Eagle Rare store pick. There is a bottle option so you could potentially win a bottle tonight very least you'll be getting some sam skis from me you get a sample of something what i don't know you're just gonna have to wait and see christmas is gonna be a christmas surprise let's see is it this one nope all right i'm gonna do one more and then I'm, just, I'm just gonna give up this is this is taking too much time i'm ready to get into this friggin' flight it's friday we made it through another week. It was, once again, it wasn't that bad. But, it, you know, Chris, it, it, uh, we're here. I don't know which one it was. Wasn't that one. Wasn't that one. Wasn't that one. Hmm. Interesting. Man, I don't know. I'm just I'm bummed that your your messages aren't popping up. That like that's part of the fun. You know? That's part of it. What is this one? Not it. Alright. I I'm gonna have to obviously come through here and just fix I need to get my life together, guys. Like I really screwed the pooch. Seven days, yeah, I don't know. I'll read your messages, though. Don't worry. Your messages will be read. It's just, I don't know why. Or maybe it's this one. Nope. It is the globe, though. Alright, guys, I'll have to... That's it. There's going to be dang... We got, hey, I found it, I found it, don't worry, okay, okay, this is it, <laughs> we're here, you're seeing behind the scenes frustration, so, alerts, let's see, when I, whenever we get this, right here, here we go, settings, here we go, Text. It's here. Let's see if we can do a um. Let's see if I can test. 
I can't even test. It's because I'm live. Whatever, man. This is just... <laughs> Whatever, dude. Whatever. I'm just... I'm over it. I, I'll read your messages. Tom Flanagan, you're in. Tim Evans, cheers, Trev. Freaking love you guys. Man, that just makes me mad. Okay. Greer Crabtree, James Taylor, Friday at Fred's with Doug, D. Willett, Look at all these people who snuck in here, you creepers. <laughs> yes. So, anonymous. That's Michelle. Cheers, my love for Trev goes way back. Keep killing it, my friend, <laughs> says Michelle. So, I read your message. Maybe you didn't want to be named, but I'm naming you because you're a friggin' legend. And you get, <laughs> you get the drums. Kevin Campbell coming in. Thanks for being you, Trev. Thanks for being Kevin. I freaking love you. In ADHD whiskey, Matt, my answer is yes. Of course, I'll do it. I didn't get back to you, but it's what I do, man. I help you. It's what we do. Yeah, I have little, do you see these, those, the gifts of the different things? Um, they're all different. I have different Easter eggs, so you just have to find them. So let's let's just get into it. This is the weird. This is the weird stuff. Let's get into it. I'm I'm tired of waiting. Tired of waiting. Donnie, is, are there rules to this? Are there rules? Yeah, one lime at a time. Due to technical difficulties, we'll just have to drink more bourbon. Exactly. I'm gonna read them, and then next time you're. I can assure you your messages will be on screen, but for now, at least your name is up there. Your name will be up there. Doug H., proudly wearing my Bourbon Rich t-shirt. What? What? Guys, if you wear, if you have a shirt and you like it, send me, take a picture and send it to me. I'll post you somewhere. It's awesome. What the heck is this? <laughs> we just got started. What it? I'm a, a. The rules. Guess the proof. Guess the type of wh type of whiskey. Guess the distillery and the expression. This is meant to be fun. Well, I could tell you right now. The heck is that? There's something wrong with this one already. Maybe not wrong, but I was not expecting this. I was not expecting this. Dough. It smells like dough. Bread dough. Send pics of yourself wearing only Trev's shirts. Yes. Farnor, what what account are you on? <laughs> yeah, Amy, this is this is broken. This is strange. We're already off to strange. Someone is going to be confused tonight, says friggin' Mrs. Linux Cat. You guys are evil. Diano, I, what is this? It's called Wild Wacky. It is tonight's blind. And I could, one is already, some something's up with this. This is not normal. Let's just taste them. I'm not even going to go through the names because each one I feel like is going to be something's off. Cool running. What's up? <laughs> Dude. What the? What the heck is that? What even is that? Donnie, that's this is not good, guys. A A is not good. There's something wrong with it. This is tainted. This is this is this is spoiled. The pal, okay, the nose, I could tell like something's off with this one. The taste is bad. This is like this is flavored with something. Oh, 
that is that is bad. This is probably some dickle freaking Tabasco sauce or dickle this flavored something. No, Austin Phillips, and that this is this is more than just craft. If this is craft, then I'm sorry, but it's not heading in the right direction. This has been altered. This has been altered with something. Andrew Buchanan. What, you want to know what's going on in here? Bad. Bad things are going on in here. Bad things. Uh-oh. Austin Feltz is sending me friggin' photos, you legend. Oh, I should. I need to keep it down. The baby's sleeping. Victoria C., what's up? It's not altered. So this is just... This is just the way it's meant to be. Not for me. This is... This tastes altered. <laughs> Donnie says it's not altered. Oh no. It's not Malort. JG, I've had Malort. And it, I feel like Malort's much worse than what this would be. The nose smells like just craft doughiness. The taste, man, is bad. That there's something up with that. I'm, I can't put my. Have you guys ever played the Bean Boozled Jelly Bean game? You know, it's like you. There's like different colored ones and it could be this flavor or one of them could be something really bad. This has a note that tastes like one of the bean boozled bad ones, like the dog food flavored bean boozled. That's what it, this tastes like, the dog food one. The, so the red friggin' bean is that it has a note like that on this or something. It's it's. I'm sorry, whoever this is, whoever makes this, I'm sorry. Just, just take it, please. It's not for me, man. In fact, I, I don't think this is for humans. Okay, so we're off to a great start. <laughs> I have no guesses. There, you know, the proof kind of throws me off just because it has this, I wouldn't say burn, it just has like a tinge. It has a tinge to it, right? And it's like, I don't know. It, it burns you in the places that you don't want to be burned type type burn. And it's not good. I'm, I'm just, I'm done for that with that one for now. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with it. I don't want it. Don't want it near me. Ooh, I just... I just burped and tasted the bean boozled. No, I I would not feed this to Biggin. Biggin gets higher quality stuff, okay? That's just the way it goes. Another PayPal coming in. Clifford! And he didn't say I'd leave a message. But Clifford, I appreciate you. You're entered in the giveaway. You, you're, you might be able to get to spin the wheel, and you might win a bottle. The end of the month. You might win a bottle tonight. There's no telling. And it's all a surprise. What the bottle... The Eagle Rare store pick, that's what we're giving one of those away at the end of the month. I'll try and throw in some other store picks in that giveaway. I want it to be awesome. I want you guys to feel like you're trying for something. Tonight, if you win the bottle, we'll discuss it. If. It's a gamble. You want to gamble? All right, guys, let's try B. I'm not excited after going off of Bean Boozled Whiskey to B. Show me where the bad whiskey touched you. Can't. No. <laughs> Stanley Wagner friggin' Jr. What is up, buddy? Cletus Sutman. Does Glass A make you wish you lost your taste again? Honestly, like... Imagine, okay, so if I came back from COVID and all whiskey tasted like that, I would be, I would be cold turkey done with all whiskey. It's done. 
I'm a born again man. B. Okay. Thank you, Donnie, for not sending me all the flavored beans and bean boozled. This one taste. This one smells like just. It smells like bourbon. <laughs> Good old bourbon. This one's bourbon. I'm already calling it. Just coming off of that, of how bad I don't even know what this is. This is just. This is just whiskey. This is bad whiskey. That's what that is. Old man Joe. Sorry I'm late. It's been one of those days. Glad I'm here on Friday night. I'm glad you're here. We're just getting started, brother. People keep flowing in here. Nick Foles, have you ever tried the zombie Skittles? No. I didn't I don't even know what that is. I don't think I want to. Let's try it. Let's try B. This this smells way better. I can tell you right now. Like we're getting the goods in this. Hmm. Nothing's really jumping out as weird on that one. Um. May, so there is a little drying note. So maybe this is finished in something, and that's what classifies it as weird. But. I'm gonna go back in. That taste was really flat, so that I feel like this is like 90 proof, or even lower. Huh, Jeremy? Evening, everyone. What's up, buddy? Bubble bath, friggin' bourbon. Take any bubble baths lately? What did I just get? I just got a thing, but it didn't pop up on my screen. Oh, you just sent me the PayPal. So Steve Dameron's in, listening to the stream while driving, so no drinking for me tonight, but I definitely want one in on the giveaway. All right, buddy. Let me make sure you didn't say anything else. Yep, you're in. So we got a lurker. He's out on the road right now listening to my show. Steve, friggin' legend, you're in on the giveaway. And here's the good thing, and I keep going on because I, I thought this wheel, when this wheel pops up, I'm proud of the wheel, okay? <laughs> um... I just, I want it to be like, if you didn't win the wheel, you still got a chance. You still, and it's, you can accumulate chances as the weeks go. So when we do this big giveaway, I'll ensure there's other prizes other than the Eagle Rare store pick in that one. So your, your chances are going to multiple things. It's the holiday season. It's time to give, baby. Yeah, I would, I'm, I'm starting to think maybe this, and it would be a, a finished bourbon. Maybe. I'm just trying to think of what, what is wild about this. What is wild and wacky? Because on the nose, it just it doesn't really... Nothing's jumping out of saying like, Hey, I was in a wine barrel. The more I'm thinking about it, the more, more I'm convincing myself that I'm smelling friggin' grapes and wine. But... I don't know. Maybe I'm getting too much in my head. What's wild and wacky? Yeah, there's like a... I always get this drying note. It's the same dr type of drying note when you drink like a Cabernet. Um, that's why I think it might be finished. <laughs> Old Man Joe, Friday... At last, count me in. You're in, old man Joe. I'm sorry your message didn't pop up, but I'm reading it. 13 and 18 Shelby. Long time lurker, first time caller, drinking Sam Houston 14 batch Tennessee 01. That's the one I got that we're getting into later. Uh, from down here in Tennessee. Cheers, Trev. Cheers, buddy. You were doing good. Donnie says you're doing good. I mean, all I said was B is finished. Low proof, you know, between 85 and 90, 86 and 90, nothing's 85. One is just bad. It's just bad whiskey. That's that's my guess. 90 proof. I don't know. No idea. Just bad. I don't want to, I don't even want to go back to it. C. C is considerably darker than the other ones. I haven't even taken that into consideration. This one's almost like 
That's like a red tinge to it. I don't like it. That one is very light. A little bit like uh, dehydrated urine. You pee that color, you need to drink water. This one looks like whiskey that you want to drink. What? Dude. Jerry Black, here's to a great Friday. Cheers, Jerry, you're in. Donnie, what the heck? What is this? <laughs> Gosh. Oh, man. This, what? These are notes. I've, I've smelled these notes before. They're like, but they're not things that you should be smelling in whiskey. Oh, no. This is like plum, but like a bad plum. Bad plum. What are those trees? You know, that was a plum tree. Yeah, this is a bad plum. That's what this is. I don't know. I don't like this. <laughs> Whatever this is, I do not like this. Dark equals sherry finish, especially if you get... The, so, okay, then I don't know. That is so light. So maybe that isn't finished in something. But it is the most bourbon-like. Between A and C? Dude. That's what he did. He's trying to screw with me. He put a normal or a normal or a more normal one in between two freaking weird ones. Wait. Really, really strong molasses. Something just screamed molasses, but like just like true molasses. Yeah, yeah, that's what it is. That's what it is. 13 and 18 Shelby. I'm just going to start calling you Shelby from now on. So I don't have to say 13 and 18 every time. Feel like I'm already part of the fam. I see you in all the channels. Finally, I had to make a channel to join in the fun myself. And shout out from Trev. This is so cool. This is cool. Welcome. D quit lurking. This is fun. We welcome you. I welcome you. You're here. Let's taste this. This is also not for me. This I would say it's less... Maybe A, I, seen, I thought was just rancid. This seems like maybe they tried something that I just don't agree with. <laughs> Dude. This is pro... That's molasses. That's gotta be molasses. Because I don't really like molasses. This is this is a whiskey finished in a rum barrel. Calling it. That is. I wouldn't want to drink this. Cletus, the most haunted flight. Drink at your own risk. Anonymous, eight seven seven mash now. Okay, okay JG, <laughs> you're in. Yeah, I'm calling this, this has got to be, I, you know, I've never had this stuff, so I'm just making it up. I'm totally making this crap up. But, this is like, this is some kind of rum. Did you see, I think my, my I think my camera is smudged, is what I think. Because look at my glass reflecting light. There's like a beam of light on this thing. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Yeah, JG, you forgot to add your name. I knew it was you. <laughs> ADHD whiskey, are these malty? I don't know. I don't... None of... What do you mean? Like, when I think of malty, I think of, like, scotch. I just... Malt. It's all malt. No rum. Well, this isn't rum. This is finished in a rum barrel. How about that? Is that a thing? This is molasses, dude. I've convinced myself that that's what that, that is. If, if, if that's not a thing, then I made it up, but 
if it was a thing, this is what it would taste like. Oh, dude. It's not for me. That is not for me. Mmm. That is like... Dude, no, I don't like it. I don't like it. It sucks the moisture right out of my tongue. This is like I'm on a sea ship. I'm a sea lad. I'm Jason friggin' Busey. I'm a seaman. And I was like, man, my whiskey, I need to put it in some other vessel. And I poured it into a rum barrel. And I was like, surely that can't make it bad. And then the vessel breaks. And I'm like, oh no, my whiskey. What am I going to do? So I start licking that liquid off of the broken barrel. So I'm getting the wood and the in the in the seaweed i don't know i don't know where this is going just it's you're on a ship and there's pirates and rum and molasses that's i'm going all in baby this is this is not for me maybe there's something else about this maybe this funkiness i'm getting is from somewhere else and i just totally dove into the sea pirates and i'm totally wrong but I would I hope that's what it is cuz I prefer sea pirates. Otherwise then this is just from Texas or something. I don't know. Cuz Texas has weird crap. A lot of their stuff tastes weird. So maybe that's what this is. But I'm leaning on sea pirates. Maybe it is Texas. Is this Texas? Texas or Sea Pirates? That's my my initial go through. Texas or Sea Pirates. Any glass that gives you wood, I guess, is a good thing. <laughs> uh, let me hold on. It is. It's it. <laughs> It's very wood and molasses and Let's check out the color. No. Mm. I need to get that flavor out of my mouth. Doug H. Drinking with Friday at Fred's. Enjoying the bourbon wrench. Wait a minute. Friday at Fred's with Doug. Got it. I got it. Sorry it took me so long. Definitely need a live stream next September on National Talk Like a Pirate Day. I'll do it, and we're going to drink this. Even if this isn't anything to do with friggin' rum, we're drinking it. Because it reminded me of it for a split second. So if we just close our eyes and pretend, it's whatever. Okay, we're going to D. It's also not my favorite. If Donnie didn't tell me that there was no scotch in this, I would probably go with this is kind of scotchy. This is some kind of malt. There's maltiness in this. This reminds me of scotch. This has something to do with scotch related to it. So this is higher malt or something. A little bit of little bit of grossness behind that. Yeah, also not for me. Like B is the only one of these that I really would just want to drink more of. <laughs> because this this is weird too. What the heck, man? What is this? Japanese maybe no well he Donnie said it's just it's just whiskey so I don't know what is just whiskey I think we got so Stanley did a giveaway he so he Dan, Stanley I got your PayPal thing he said 
What's up, legend? What is the giveaway? By the way, go Navy. Okay, whatever, dude. The giveaway, two of them, you're entered into, into a list. The list is randomized. A winner is picked. The winner, there's a wheel that's going to pop up here. You get to spin the wheel. Whatever, the, whatever it lands on is your reward for tonight. Everyone's names from the list is carried into next week. You were also entered into a month end of month giveaway for a bottle of Eagle Rare store pick. Plus, you know, I'm imagining other bottles are going to be on that too. So, your it's your name goes to two lists: tonight's wheel spin and the end of month bottle giveaway. So, maybe Balcon Balcones Baby Blue. Maybe. I've never had that, but I bet you this is what it tastes like. Not for me. It's not for me. I don't know. Donnie. I don't know, man. It's just... What the heck? Are you getting a ton of corn in that? You know, kinda. I'm getting some essence of mellow corn. So yeah, corn. I don't know, man. This is... It... Mmm. No. What the heck? It goes down like water, though. Like, it, it feels like I'm drinking literal water. Just how there is nothing going on but this flavor. This bad flavor. There is no... It feels like water. You know, I don't like to say the word smooth. Because it's... it's, it's when I say water, it's more than just smooth. It feels like gross flavored water. Is what I'm like tainted water. I scooped up some water from a creek and there was a dead animal up the way. That's this. There we go. Dead animal. <laughs> and corn. The animal was eating corn and died in the stream. And then now I'm drinking it. Sounds like Basil Hayden. <laughs> Texas. You know, that's what's weird. Like, I have a Texas and it doesn't taste like any of these. But then again, it's like... I do get... I'm get, Maybe that maltiness that I was getting is, is actually extreme corn. Everyone's saying Balcones baby blue. Which I have no idea. I've never had that. Always drink upstream from the herd just in case you die and taint the water. I'm out. I'm out. Donnie, spoiler alert, no Texas. Now what do we do? Our whole game plan's over. Oh no. I I don't know, man. I have no idea then. Because... I don't know. It, it, this one... So, I'm going to have to compare A and D because they're honestly kind of giving me similar vibes of the rotten, spoiled nature.
honestly, going back to A after having D, it smells way better. Okay, so tasting A again, and then we're going to taste D. Dude. Mm -mm. That's still, that's the bean boozled flavor, I'm telling you. The nose, though, is, is better, or not as bad. The, the taste on A, though, is freaking bad. D. Nose, not good. Tainted. It smells like taint. It smells like an actual human being's taint. And it tastes like... Taint. Not for me. Not for me, man. Oh. I will give A, though. I will give A. The A smells better than the D. I would much rather smell this A than this, this big old D. Bubble bath, bourbon, $5. You drink the D and have died of dysentery. <laughs> oh, good old Oregon Trail, man. Yeah. Not good. The A... Smells much better than the D, but they taste, to me, probably just eat. I think A might taste worse, but overall, D is worse just because it's it smells and tastes bad. So, yeah, Kevin, we're. I I can't tell you what this tastes like because it's like, it's it's just it's. I don't like it. It's not good. Not only do I not like it, it it literally tastes tainted. I'm Donnie. Watch this be like your favorite thing ever. I agree. A and D do not taste as good as they should. Something is amiss, and I apologize. That was not the intent. Donnie, even if it wasn't your intent, like, those just aren't for me, man. And maybe I'm exaggerating the badness. I just, I don't like it. I don't like it. So... If it's like a Tennessee, are you doing some weird, y'all, you guys are doing some weird stuff in Tennessee. If this comes from Tennessee. Well, you sent me a Tennessee blind. I don't know. I don't like them tonight. Maybe there's something in the air. Do you, nor Donnie, do you normally like these? Because... Like, honestly, A, the taste on A, I just genuinely do not like it at all. D, I would say A I, is just bad. D, I can see maybe they're just trying something that's not for me. So, we have loved them in the past. Maybe they not do well after opening. Dude, A, though... <laughs> Something's... I, I do not like the taste of A. D, I don't like the nose. Again, it, it, there's something weird about it. They're just... I would pass on these, Donnie. I would pass on them. Um... If I have to guess proof, like D, it's really low. Like, I don't know, 86. Drinks that way anyway. Because I am I really only get the flavor, and the flavor is what I really don't like. Like, I wish maybe if it was higher proof and it could mask some of the flavor. I don't know. Donnie, I don't... I think it's funny. I'm glad I don't like them. I'm glad I found something that I just don't like. Because everyone, you know, is talking about this is the best, or this is the best, or I don't like that. I want to know what I don't like. Hold on, let me go to B and C. B, I, B, I like. I, I really like this one.
It's not bad. It's lower proof, too. Um, I don't know. Around 90 is my guess on that one. I think it's it's finished or something. There's something... But not, not to in a, a great extent. Okay? There's something... There's something going on, though. Maybe they just didn't... Maybe they just didn't, you know... They didn't do it correctly, but I'm, I'm liking it. It's on the right track. C. This was the, this was the C. I kept saying this was the pyro. Yeah, man, like molasses. I'm getting a lot of molasses. Maybe around a... I'm out. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like C either. I don't know. Like a hundred proof, and I don't like it. Very molassesy. It's like I just licked some raw molasses goo. Or maybe that's... I promise this was not meant to be bad. <laughs> well, Donnie, we found some stuff that I just don't like. Okay, give your... Guess on A. Hmm. Nose is fine. Taste really don't like. Ninety proof. This is just a this is a whiskey or something. I don't know. I have no get Donnie, these flavors, aside from B, A, C, and D are things I have never tasted in my life ever. Austin Feltz, ten dollars. I went in on these these goodies. Well you're in. You're in, in both of them, brother. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> A. Woodford Reserve Master's Collection Chocolate Malted Rye. 90 proof. So I said 90 proof. Friday at Fred's with Doug. Cheers from the Big Easy. Cheers, buddy. You guys are both in. Chocolate Malted Rye. So... Like I said, the nose is fine, especially going back to it. The nose is good. You, it is fine, but the palate, man, that Donnie, this you know what this makes me think of? That chocolate, the Rocktown chocolate, chocolate. I don't even know what they called theirs, but it's like the same version, like a cho chocolate malted rye at Rocktown. It taste like it tasted way better than this. That Rocktown chocolate one. I actually got chocolate on the Rocktown one. This one, I'm... There was... Let me... let me Going back into this thinking chocolate. So, that might be chocolate that you open the package and then you left it outside for three weeks I don't know that's kinda of what I'm getting thinking chocolate okay I will, I will give it this I will give it this now that I have chocolate in my head this leftover taste that's in my mouth, it does, honestly, honestly, maybe it's just power of suggestion, it does feel like I had, I have eaten chocolate, okay? But it's like, you eat the chocolate, and then you go about your business, and then, you know, a minute later, like, it's that, it's like leftover chocolate. But when you're drinking it, it is not freaking chocolate. This this aftertaste is chocolate, but to which I really like. But to drink this to get the aftertaste, no, I don't want to do that. Not gonna do it. Richie, I need to try that Rocktown bottle. It was good, Donnie. That that Rocktown one we tried, the chocolate one, I enjoyed it. It and it was heavy chocolate. Okay, let's go on to B.
I'm saying this is some kind of bourbon finished or I don't know. It does fall kind of flat on the palate though. But it's got to be like a bourbon finished or some kind of altered with something else. <laughs> I don't know. Again, lower proof. Um, I'm going to say maybe in the low 90s. little higher than 90. Jim Beam Legion, Kentucky Straight Bourbon Whiskey, partially finished in wine and sherry casks, 94 proof. I should have known that, Donnie. You, because I made you in the store, I made you freaking tell me that Legion was one of the bottles. I didn't even think of that. I didn't even, I just remembered when you said Legion, I go, wait a minute. Donnie said Legion was in one of the blinds. I, yeah, it's good. It's on the right track. I think it's just lacking. It's like they found something good and then like, let's turn it down. Let's water it down and dial it back. The nose was fine. I could tell just slightly like, barely finished like I, just, I knew that it was like just subtle finishing like something was weird about it they, they didn't they didn't do enough I guess I, I think they tried I think they probably went in it playing it pretty safe so all right see um this was the molasses -y one this got this has to this has to be something with rum and if it's not, it's probably just going to be like Texas whiskey or something. I don't know. Proof. I don't know. I, I dislike it so much. Diana says I'm wrong. I honestly, like, that's the thing. I really just don't like it. So all I can focus on is that. There we go. Chat, chat, it, I can't even say it. Chattanooga Whiskey Distillery, Chattanooga Whiskey Experimental Single Batch Series M Mead. What is freaking mead? Is that what you, is that what they made in the medieval times? Mead? <laughs> mead barrel finished. Mead is, it's honey. It's honey. This isn't molasses. It's honey. I'm an idiot. This, <laughs> that, is, that is honey through and through. I'm so dumb. This does taste like honey, but I don't particular. I like honey, but I per don't particularly like, maybe I, let me go into it thinking honey. ADHD whiskey, that's why he's the freaking world's top whiskey taster. He knew exactly what this was. I should have known. I'm so bad. I kept saying molasses, but this, I mean, that is, that, this is only honey. This is honey and alcohol. Still dislike the taste. It tastes like honey mixed with vomit. Yeah. The nose I, is much more tolerable, but it's very honey. It, it's almost just like normal honey and vodka, <laughs> just, just, just alcohol. But the taste is where the vomit comes in. I don't like it. But yeah, that weird funkiness. Eric Hetzler, he's had it. It's honey with some weird funk. Yeah, that weird funk is just not... 
Actually, Trev, I thought it tasted like urine and honey, not vomit. My bad. Well, urine is sterile, and I like the taste. Anyway, moving on to D, which was the taint. This is sweaty taint. Don't like this one either, man. And maybe I'm being too hard on it, but let me get let me guess approve. Man, I, I don't like it. I don't know. Ninety again. I they they feel low approve. Sweaty taint. We are talking whiskey, right? <laughs> William Davilar just joined in this. A scotch blind? No. No, it is not. I'm feeling bad for the Linux cats right now. I'm telling you, like, I'm not, Donnie, I'm not trying to make you guys feel bad or anything. I just do not, these are not for me. Taste is subjective. If someone likes this, power to you. But me, my tongue, says no. I do not want that. I do, don't come near me. I don't want that. D, and then D, he says, does not taste right. We feel bad that A and B were so off. No, B was not off. B was the Legion, and I thought it was fine. I actually liked it. I mean, it could be better, but... Focus a camera. A and D. Yeah, D, man, something. Honestly, D might, might be my least favorite. Stanley Wagner Jr., I saw that. I want to win. What E.H. Taylor is that? Where do you see E.H. Taylor in here? Oh, right there behind me. It's the small batch. It's all we... All I can get around here. I got actually got that in Memphis with Donnie. I saw that. I saw that. Also, are you giving away those shirtless 2021 calendars at the end of the month? Hey, whoever it, whoever wins the end of the year giveaway, I'll you can have a shirtless calendar. I'll make one for you <laughs> if you so want it. Kelsey Dime, I saw you in here earlier and I got distracted. That small batch, it's one of my favorite. It's really good. All right, Donnie, what's D, man? What is D? Let us know, cause I, I want to, I want to pour, I want to pour this freaking Sam Houston, man. D. H. Clark Distillery, Thompson Station, Tennessee, black and tan, eighty proof. Okay, I sh like I said, I guess ninety, but I'm just throwing something out there. But I did say it went it it was like water. What is black and tan? What is that? It is a it is distilled from beer. Well, DC black and tans are delish. You might like that, but I don't want it. <laughs> and that's the thing. I'm not a big beer person, so maybe maybe that did. Tastes like what a black and tan would taste like? I have no idea. I, I could not tell you what a black and tan tastes like. But, I, I do not like that. DC, this is what, you know what, you know DC, I'm saving the rest of this, and whenever I send your package out, you'll get it, and you can try it. <laughs> tell me what, what, tell me if this tastes like black and tan. How about that? You can try a fresh crack of black and tan sometime. I don't know, Donnie. Like, so you said it's off. Is this not what it normally tastes like? That's just, it's so weird. An oatmeal stout beer. Guys, I'm not the beer dude. You guys are coming in. It, it's half stout and half beer. I can't even... You know what? You guys... I may lose some followers for this, but you know what kind of beer I drink? I'm out on the lake. 
I reach into my cooler in my captain's hat and I'm pulling out a fresh ice cold natty light okay that's what I'm drinking out on the lake <laughs> natty light natural light baby so let's just move these guys out of the way um, no Donnie Donnie thank you for the flight that was fun okay it's fun William sexy names unsubscribing William better watch out Diana thank you Donnie thank you I freaking love you guys I don't care if I didn't like it that's that's the that's the point of this to find out we got to know this stuff we got to know this you're not 18 anymore stop drinking natural light get some help bubble bath how, how do you think I keep my youth this is the natty light Yep, there we go. DC dropping in the thing. List one, tonight's giveaway. Get entered in a chance to spin the whiskey wheel. I feel like people are confused about that. Let's just give a little... Uh, here's a sneak peek at the whiskey wheel. You got two samples. Sample and a cigar. Spin again. A flight. Two samples and a cigar. Sample... A, just look at all these rewards you could win on. A bottle's on there. But now it's gone. Poof. You just, you'll get to spin the wheel. The wheel will spin and will pick your reward for you. But also, also, if you don't win, you're still on a list for, we're, and we're, I'm making it happen. It's multiple bottle giveaway at the end of the month. Which, my grand prize of that will be Eagle Rare Store Pick on in that giveaway. So you're entered in both. If you win a wheel spin, so if you're selected to spin the wheel tonight, um, you're getting an extra addition to it all the way. There, too. So, Will Henderson, did you get mine? Did I get your what? Did you enter? Your entry. I'm not seeing it, brother. Because I have all of the things here. I can tell you everyone who's done it. It's done. It doesn't like you, Will. My, my entry thing does not like Will. Donnie. For the right price, I may have a screenshot of the wrench's abs. I got you, Will Henderson. I'm sorry. You should have just told me that. Not sure why you know what taint tastes like, but you do you, bro. Listen here, Will. Don't knock until you try it. Richie, do you have a Christmas wish bottle? Mine is 2020 William LaRue Weller. Honestly, Richie, come on. You know, WLW, that's always on my wish list. Easily one of the best, best ones I've ever had. Screen freeze in my back? Guys, you did have some lag. My little green box down here turned red. And then instantly turned yellow. And then it's back to green. Amy! Donated 10 bucks. Here's to all not great beers in bourbon. May they be honored. Still love them. Be back in a bit. Cat got out. Gotta go chase him down. Speak, you know, where's Biggin? Biggin's over on the bed. He he doesn't even care now. Alright, so we got, we were making, we have plenty of time. So you know what that means, right? Oh no. Where did I put the Sam Houston? I'll be right back. I gotta go. The Sam Houston's friggin' over there. I didn't even get it. 
We'd love to get some BTEC someday, any of them. Honestly, the only one that I even that we can even get here is um George T. Stagg, and it's in the in raffle. They in our in our raffles, they there's no other BTEC. Only George T. Stagg. All right. I'll be back in one second. I'm going to go grab the Sam Houston 14. Gary Franchi, I just can't resist a wheel spin. You going to have a chance to. And you know what? I'm 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 thinking I'm thinking if we keep up, if people keep giving giving entries, there might be two wheel spins tonight. There might be. But yeah, you're entered in both. You're entered in the giveaway. Later on, and Klein, Destination Freaking Bourbon's showing up. What the hell is going on here? You missed it. You missed me drink things that I didn't like. They weren't necessarily bad. I just did not like them. All right, let me go grab the Sam Houston. Bam. You may notice that it's already opened. That's because I opened it as soon as I freaking got it. This bottle was hand delivered by none other than D friggin C, the legend. This is a special unicorn bottle. This is like no other Sam Houston 14. Limited edition U.S. Army edition. Go Army. It makes it taste... It's better. It's better than all the batches you've ever had. I can tell you that. And that's what we're going to... We're going to get into it. Tonight. Right now. DC. Legend amongst men. That's what we're getting into, baby. Let me make sure I didn't miss any others. You guys keep sneaking, sending me PayPal's through normal PayPal and not the, not the link. So, so that is not from one of the state batches. So, Donnie, it is. This is Tennessee 01. And I guess that's it. That's all we need to know. Batch size two barrels. Two barrels? That's it? But yeah, this is Tennessee 01. DC. I mean, he found this like this. U.S. Army stickers all over this guy, man. Plastered with them. One of a kind. No one else has it. And it tastes better than the normal Tennessee batch one. So let's get into it. Whoa. My quality went down over there. I hope you guys saw it, see me good. Okay, we're good. We're good. We good. We're good. I saw someone up. Chris Sprague. What's up, Chris Sprague? I freaking love you. Welcome to the party. Man, this is good. Here we go, Donnie. This is delicious. This is good. This has like the perfect amount of barrel char that I like. It's it's burnt enough. It's like you take the marshmallow and you you let it you let it get into the fire and it just starts to combust and then you blow it out. So it's a nice toasted semi-burnt marshmallow perfect amount austin feltz that's why i freaking love you go army we have a lot of navy people in here and my army people aren't here so victoria c says go okay victoria c freaking love you yes give dc some more love man dc see okay i i, I got it 
we got to keep talking about DC. So another thing that I really enjoy with with these care packages, I love like cards and stuff like that. So when, you know, Sherry G, she sent me this awesome coin. She wrote she sent me a handwritten letter. DC sent me a freaking Christmas card. I love that stuff, man. Freaking love it. There we go, Jerry Black. Mm. Go Army. Beat Navy. This is what why I'm really pissed off that it's not putting up his words. Because I could have totally made that up. But he said it. He said it. Ryan Tarpy. There we go, baby. There we go. Miss Linux Cat is pouring Tennessee Batch 1 of Sam Houston 14 so we can drink with you. No, this is this is really good. This is definitely, like I said, it's like the perfect amount of barrel char on this. I have Tennessee 01 bottle 31 of 492. What number did you get? 108 of 492, which is the limited edition army bottle. It's monumentally more expensive, drastically better tasting. So I'm sorry that you didn't get that one, but this one, that this is it. Only one. All right, let's taste it. Cheers, my friends. Yeah. Yeah. My dad was staff sergeant in the army. Miss Lennox Cat dad was a staff sergeant and he enjoyed eating crayons in the Marines. So thank you. <laughs> hey, we get to do that. But no. The Marines, as much crap as I give them, they're not the Air Force. Come on. There's like zero Air Force people in the chat, man. Exponentially more rare. It is. And the Army bottle is stronger than any others. It, I mean, this is bulletproof. Just poured my Georgia 01. I think DC's bottle may be better. What, what do you get on the Georgia one? I am curious as to how... Um, Will, we need to, if you haven't tried the Tennessee, like if you want to swap samples of it, I, I, I'm interested in to see how the, the different batches, like the different states taste. I have no idea. Daniel Simonson, my best friend on the planet, literally. Guys, tell me, tell me this while Daniel's in here. Daniel is actually my best friend. We grew up together. He it lives down the road. He, I, I have been working into getting him into whiskey, so would you like to see an episode with Daniel as I try to, I torture him with whiskeys to see what he thinks about him? It's like the amateur, noob, total noob, total beginner. See what he thinks of the whiskey. That's what we're going to do. Daniel, it's already decided. The people don't have to speak. It's happening. That's because Air Force people can't handle anything of above 5% alcohol. Whiskey is way out of their capabilities. It is very hard working in the office. Oh, yeah. This guy, this is so freaking good. And I'm glad, like, DC, he said it, he sent, he said this is his favorite, was one of his favorite bottles, if not the favorite bottle of the year. And this is, this is good. It, it, I hate when things taste that good because it's like, I have no, you know, you, 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 I, I can't just go get this. So that's what makes me mad when I really enjoy it. What's up, Swanee? Crisis averted, Trev. It's coming to you. I saw. I saw what you're talking about. I got distracted once again, but I did see you. Welcome, Swanee. 
Daniel says, I would love to have an excuse. I would have to excuse myself halfway through the stream. No, the people want you. <laughs> Mike Cook, yes. Also, lurker check in. Lurkers, where you at? Check in. Lurkers, I know you're out there. You're lurking. You're sitting. You're probably reaching for your phone right now saying, oh, oh no, I have to check in. Yeah, you. I'm talking to you. Will Henderson, that Georgia is super char on the nose. Then it's super spicy oak on the palate. Not much else. I was hoping for more. See, I wouldn't say super char on this. Like a Knob Creek, like I have some Knob Creek 15s that are super char. The, the Wild Turkey 17, super char. This seems to be toned down a bit. It, it's there. And then you say super spicy oak. Hmm. Hold on. We're back in business. I don't know, man. There is a lot of oak on this, for sure. But I like oak. Now, I wouldn't say, like, Elijah Craig 18 oak, but the oak is present, and I, I, to me, in my palate, it's the, the right amount of oak, okay? Knob Creek store pick 15s are glorious. Get them while they last. Exactly. I'm, I've been stocking up as I see them. It's char number four, says on the bottle. So, it, it you know, it is going to be super charred, um, and I like that. It just it doesn't drink as much like super char this one anyway as others I've had. Andrew Buchanan, lurking is fun. I'm driving and listening. Love lurking. Uncle Buck, freaking love you. James SoCal, checking in, lurking. Eric, I was lurking until I had to take a shot at the chair force. Yes. Weights and whiskey. Trying not or trying tr I'm trying not to be better. I'm trying to be better about not lurking. I've, I've seen you chatting in there. You, you're stepping your game up, brother. One more rep. That's all I ask. Kilka, lurking is life. You don't lurk. Clifford, lurker up. We want to see you wear that ju what Julie L. sent you. Maybe. Maybe. Will Henderson... That is a good question. So, where is your Lurker shirt? I have a Lurker logo that I made. I don't think it's up to my, up to standard. It doesn't seem Lurker enough, if that makes sense. I'm working. I'm, I'm going to work on it. Because I, I need a Lurker freaking t-shirt. I need the Lurker shirt. Chair Force comments? Yes. Please. Uh-oh, Bev. Watch it with the Air Force comments. Uh-oh. JG, Trev likes wood. I love the wood. Swanee, there you go. You're entered into two giveaways, brother. Cheers. He says cheers. Swanee, thank you. I'm just watching the GIF that I put on there. <laughs> I, I hope you guys like these, the GIFs that I do. GIFs, GIFs. Hope you like the little video that I did. I have, there's multiple tiers of of these, and we've seen two of them. Friggin', friggin' Michelle, sexy named Avalar, came in earlier, got to see the Will Ferrell drums. I hope there are tassels. The Julie L costume is Patreon only. Join, thank you for minding me. Um, DC, because I need to thank a couple new Patreons. Mark Royland, he is a junior inch, making his way up. But thank you. You you're getting you you get a prize when you join at that level. You get you you'll end up getting a coin, which is coming. It's actively being shipped to my home. And then Sean. Oler, 
Euler. Euler. Sean O. You're in. You're, you're in the Patreon, brother. Thank you. Thank you both. Those are my two re most recent ones. Put me so close to my goal. We're we're just shy of seventy dollars away from our goal on the Patreon, and then crap's getting real. I'm talking this camera gone. This camera. That's the thing. When I hit my goal, this camera's turning into the big and cam. And then we're getting a fancy camera for me. This is the big and cam. These lights. I wish you guys could see these lights. They're not good. They're they're like plastic lights. Terrible. So we're upgrading the whole thing. Ethan Dirk, lurker, lurking ginger, checking in. Well, welcome, you soulless fool. Brian Pulver, and Friday indeed. You drinking some marai, huh? But yeah, the Patreon, if you want to join the Patreon, five, like basically the reward, like true rewards start at $5. Coins and all that's, it's coming up. For all of you who are active Patreons, again, thank you. It's coming. I'm going to start collecting your addresses here very soon. Because all the, you know, I'm, the coins are basically the last things I need to come in. I hit a red spot. Are we are we still good? We look good. Okay, we're back. Love to hear you're up to reinvesting your gear. No, Cletus. Like I said, once once I hit that goal, I'm I'm saying screw it. Camera's good. I want I'm going all in, man. I'm going all in. Yeah, the camera, it is, and I like it. I just, man, there's something about me. I always just want to be, like, the best. I just want to give the best. I want to. I want the stream to look the best. That's why I like the fancy little things popping up. I like when you donate. I like that your thing pops up. This wheel. I, I just, I like the bells and whistles, man. So I want it to look as good as it can. It is me. I'm a I'm a perfectionist. That's why I spend so much time on crap that probably none of you notice. Um, but I enjoy doing like these things down here. We got a new lurker. Did that J Pitt? When did I get J Pitt as a subscriber? Because it didn't really pop up. It must have been a while ago. But when I get someone. If someone subscribes right now, your name pulls up on the new lurker. Like, you know, I work on that stuff for no reason. Like, I, just, I want it. So, Will, when you donate, your thing pops up. I mean, does it? Is that it? I don't know, man. Between It's between you and I in our Patreon messages only. Hot buttery freaking rolls. Chris says I look magnificent. No, my friend, you do. If you guys haven't subscribed to Hot Buttery Rolls, dude is amazing. Oh, it was. Okay, J Pitt is my buddy Josh that went live with me the other night. Okay, so when he subscribed that night, it it carries over here. That's really cool. So... What I'm going to start doing while we're ahead, I'm going to start plugging in these names to spin the friggin' wheel, okay? We're spinning the wheel. So that means, with that being said, you still have time to be entered into the wheel giveaway. And it also is the, the bottle giveaway at the end of the month. So all these names will be saved. I'm going to save all of the names, and them fools going to be, um, so it, it's, a, it's going to be a big list, but this right now is for tonight's wheel spin, and I hope it works. 
I hope I'm able to spin the wheel on the stream. Just putting you all in here. And Amy, also, I just put Amy's super chat in here. Friggin' Amy just up, upped her tier on Patreon. Amy, you're freaking amazing, and I love you. I can count the hairs on your head. If you get a better camera, I'll be able to read your mind. Well, you're going to be able to read my mind, my friend. You will be able to read my mind. So, Amy, up, up to tier. We're, we're, we're in the 60s. We're in, in the $60 range between massive upgrade. She just wants the big and cam. Big and cam, it's coming. I mean, we'll get there. Eventually. Look at him. You hear him. He's saying, I need a camera for me. Where, why can't the people see me? Scary Bieber Trev just got back from anniversary dinnery. Dinnery, whoa, feeling it. Happy anniversary, congratulations. Also, Scary Peeper, already talked about you. Christmas Peeper showed up today. I put the wrench mask on him. Thank you. Total sup Dude, I was not expecting it. I was like, freaking box from Scary Peeper? Entering all these names in the giveaway real quick. This is what I do, guys. Like, so, so basically what you're watching right now is like behind the scenes. When I'm in ADA, ADHD Whiskey and all them guys, and they have a giveaway, this is what I do. I just sit here and put their names in here while I drink and talk with you guys. And I shorthand it. We'll do bubble bath. We don't need to type your whole name to know that it's you. Doug, you're in. Cletus, you're in. Anonymous, that was JG, because he said 877 MASH now. Set it up to where we can super chat, and it releases a treat to Biggin. Hey, if I could figure something out like that. But he doesn't really, like, he doesn't really do anything, like, he eats, he eats his fancy feast every day when I come home. Like, that's his thing. He loves his fancy feast. Caitlin Brubaker! Caitlin. Caitlin and I actually spent a vast majority of yesterday playing Xbox together. Now, that's not a, that's not a Patreon tier or anything, but it could be. You guys like playing Xbox. But <laughs> Caitlin and I, we played... We played for several hours. Old Man Joe, you're in. Michelle, Michelle dropped. She's the, she's the biggest super chat of the night. That's why her name, Anonymous down there, don't let it fool you. That's friggin' Michelle, sexy named Avalar. You ever had Booker's, says Austin Feltz. I have had Booker's. I've only had one batch and it was a batch that people rave about. I've had 2017-04, so sip a while. And I was not like that impressed with it. So since that was some that that's something people raved about, I kind of just haven't bought a batch since. Ron Hawkins coming in with a $5. I'll see if you left a message, but you are entered as we speak. Yeah, the, the Booker's, so I bought that batch, it was, I bought that batch for 60 bucks. So the fact that they've been raising the price, and for what? Like, I wasn't that impressed with it at $60, so what's good, why would I do, why would I pay friggin', why would I pay 80 bucks, 90, 100 bucks, when we were in Memphis, Donnie and I were going to all these stores that knew the pigskin batch, a hundred bucks. No. What? I mean, here's the thing. I haven't tried them, so maybe it was just that batch I didn't like. My thing was I just didn't want to 
if I wasn't impressed with the sixty dollar, like paying sixty bucks for it, I just didn't want to risk spending more and still not liking it. So that's why I haven't bought another one. For all I know, I really I would really like Booker's, and that was just a bench that I didn't like. But it's scary to. That's like a. That's a gamble. I I paid sixty for one and wasn't impressed. Now now I want to spend a hundred and take a gamble. I would much rather try a sample of it somewhere and see like a different batch and see if it, maybe it was just that one batch that I wasn't, you know, impressed with or what. All right, we're almost there. Just a couple more. Kevin, you're in. Kerber, he's in. Anonymous. That first anonymous. Who was that? That was Ron. It was Ron, right? Double check me. <laughs> and then Sherry G. So we're caught up. Sherry G, all she's always like my first friggin' donator. Sherry G is a true legend, man. Let's go back to the Sam Houston. We still got 18 minutes before ADHD whiskey. He gives away some stuff. How do we donate? Whiskey ride the bourbon freaking guy. I saw you say I saw you earlier. I don't know if I said hey. Maybe I did. But if not, hello. And if you want to donate. There's a link in the description. DC will probably drop it because he that's just what he does. Um, you can do multiple ways, but the link that he gives you will take you to a page. It's going to look all official. It's through PayPal. You just choose the amount you want to donate. It probably, will, probably makes you sign in through um, PayPal, and then it sends it to my PayPal, and then you'll pop up on the screen. It's the, it's the stream elements link. So that's what that is. So let me scroll up, make sure Ron Hawkins message. Ron Hawkins, you're in. He didn't leave a message. But I'm sure he said something like, Trev, thank you. And Ron, thank you. <laughs> Kevin Campbell coming back in. He says, what the hell? One more because you make my Fridays, buddy. Well, Kevin, guess what? You're going back in. And here's the thing. Like I said, guys, all of these names, this is for the wheel spin, but I'm saving all of them, and you will be in the end of the month stream, or not end of the month stream, end of the month giveaway. We'll be giving away a bottle of, It'll be randomized, and someone's going to be winning a bottle of Eagle Rare Store Pick. I'm going to be throwing in probably a Buffalo Trace Store Pick. Just multiple bottles. And, you know, it, maybe they're not that much, but hey, I'm trying to, it's a way to try and give back to you guys. So, a little something. It means your one, your one entry could, could get you, could land you something. If you win tonight, like if you're spinning the wheel, you get an additional entry. I will write it down that you get, I'm going to write your name down again on the list. So there's going to be a master list that goes at the end of the month and you'll get, um, you'll get an additional entry. I'll just write your name down again. So if you get to spin the wheel, it's just like a free $5 thing for you, essentially. Sean! Sean, how do you say your last name, bro? Wait, he didn't even pop up yet. There did he? There we go. Anonymous. I'm calling you out. It's Sean. Sean O. Oler. 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 Sean Euler. It's Oler. 
You're in. He says, cheers, man. Justin Medeiros coming in. He's want Justin Medeiros wants some freaking Eagle Rare store pick. He wants to spin the wheel, but he want you want to bottle. Whiskey and weights, I'm Sean. It's Oler. Whiskey and weights, I've been You've been Sean this whole time, man. Yeah, I got Justin. I just said Justin Medeiros wants the bottle, man. I'm still drinking this Sam Houston 14, man. This? Tell me this. So you can only get this in this in the states that they're released in. So like the Tennessee batch is only released in Tennessee. Right? So what they have a Kentucky, Tennessee, and and um Georgia? Is that what it is? Is that how that works? Do they have plans on going other places? Because I know nothing. I don't really know a whole lot about this Sam Houston. So, correct. Each state got their own batches. Correct. Correct. Okay, I got correct that. Let me let me answer this now, though. Are they planning on doing batches in other places. There was a Sam Houston, North Carolina batch. Didn't even see one. Scary P. Okay, so we got first John T came in. Cheers. Go. John T, you're out of the running. Sorry, brother. And, um, <laughs> no. John T, cheers. Go, Navy. You're in. I'm going to put negative 15 entries for you. And then Scary Peeper, I'm in for whatever we're doing tonight. Scary Peeper, you're in for what we're doing this whole freaking month. Because you might win the wheel spin tonight, but you are definitely entered in the end of the month giveaway too. So you're entered into both. Doug H, Friday night is also better with treble. Doug H, it's better with you. And you know who else it's better with? Friggin' Fred. You and Fred. It's better with you both. Let's see. Let's catch back up. Indiana, Kentucky, Texas, Tennessee, and Michigan got batches. Okay, so I thought there were three batches. The Batch twos are already out in some places. Good lord, can't type. Sitting by fire in 25 degrees. Fingers don't work. Here, let me reread that. Good lord, can't type. Sitting by four in 25 degrees. Fingers don't work. Well, Michelle, you tried. You trying. There's a ton of states. Colorado, New York, Indiana, North Carolina, New Jersey, and more. Okay, I'm... I'm dumb. I, I don't know why I thought there were friggin' three. I have no idea. What? Why did I even think that? Cool62, Chev, did you get my entry? Yep, I got you. Wait a minute. Doug H, okay. Cool 62 Chev, you're investors, right? I got it. And then Sherry G coming back in. One more for your lurker queen. Sherry G, you are the freaking queen. You're the lurker queen. I love you. And I know you're lurking. I know you're always here. Even if you're not here, you're watching the replay. Biggin, you know, Biggin's literally saying more. Give me more entries. Big and calm down, man. The people don't care. They care. Get up here. He's he's in the co-host chair. You, oh, you can see him. You see him. He's making an appearance. <laughs> Big and say hey. 
Come here. All right, there's your biggin. You got your biggin for the night, okay? Dang. Sherry, I love you. I was just looking at your, um, I was organizing the room again. Like I said, you know, when you sent me that handwritten letter, I freaking love that stuff. If you guys ever, if you ever want to send me something, you better handwrite something. You better, you better get a piece of paper and just write, hey, it's me. <laughs> I, I'm sending this. I don't know. I love that. I don't know why. All right. You guys have a couple minutes. I'm going to do, um, shoot. I need to test to see if this wheel will even show up on the, on the stream. Um, hold on. Let me see. Well, I'm totally unprepared. Hold on, guys. You're going to see me pop up. Because i got to get this wheel ready. Because someone... Someone's going to get to spend a wheel. Because we're coming up on time. I, I want to be right on time this time. So you, you guys have, like, if you want to be entered tonight for this wheel spin for tonight, you better get it in, like, right now. Okay, so I have this. Okay, so I have the wheel. The problem is, I can't, I can't test it without you seeing. Okay, here's the wheel. Okay, it spins, it spins. You don't get to see it. You don't get to see it. It spun. It it spins. The wheel spins. We tested it. It spins. It's going to pick the thing. You got... Here we go. And here's the thing. like, The rewards go from anything from just one sample to full bottle. Okay? Obviously, there's more chances of winning one sample. There's, there's two that are just one samples. There's two that are... Um, you get samples and some, some cigars if you like that. There's two sample options, so you'll be getting two samples from me. There's a three sample option. There's a flight, so you'll be getting four. There's a friggin' flight and a cigar flight, so you're going to be getting a full flight and four cigars. There's um, friggin' there's just there's all kinds of stuff. There's no telling, and it's totally random. I've spun this wheel. That's the thing. I wanted to see how random this truly was. So I've spun this wheel friggin' a hundred times just to see what it was like. And, um, at first it landed like on the bottle giveaway like three times in a row. So I was kind of like, maybe I need to change that. <laughs> Someone's going to win this bottle. <laughs> but it's totally random. There's no telling who's going to win and win what. There's no telling, man. It's a gamble. You want to gamble? J. Pitt lurking. J. Pitt, I saw you earlier. We got a new subscriber, people. <laughs> yes. Perfect. Riv Rivette. He's now lurking with us. Welcome. All right, so here's the thing. Hold on. This this is what's going to happen. I'm going to step away for one second. I'm going to come back, and we're going to do the giveaway, okay? So if you have, if you have any last-minute entries, you got to do it right now.
We're back. And we're in the cape. We're in the cape that Julie L. sent me. <laughs> Caitlin's finished up some COD games. What are you doing? We're wearing capes. We're we're about to we're about to do this wheel giveaway. So let's see. I didn't get any nope. So that's it. It's closed. It's closed. Did you win? Bourbon Jug, what are you Dan, what are you doing? Is that a cape or is it an ascot? <laughs> it's it's my version of an ascot. All right, here we go. So to spin the wheel tonight. So, like I said, all of you are entered into the bottle giveaway, the multiple bottle giveaway at the end of the month. You're in. It will be there. So each week you can add more to it. Like next week when we do the wheel, you'll get to spin the wheel, but you're you're still entered in that giveaway, okay? So all of these names are getting carried over. But for tonight, and then we're going to go over to ADHD Whiskey. We're, we're making perfect timing. So, let me randomize. 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 Hey Siri. Pick a number between one. A random number between zero and one hundred is fifty-two. I didn't say it fast enough. Hey Siri. Pick a number between one and and 43. A random number between 1 and 43 is 10. 10. Who's spinning the wheel tonight, baby? John T. John T, we're spinning the wheel. Here we go. There's there's the wheel. Okay? You see the wheel? Here we go. We're spinning it. What do you get? What are you winning? Oh, he's getting a sample and cigar flight. Are you kidding me? You're getting, you're getting freaking that. You're getting a flight of samples and you're getting a flight of cigars. That's that's what it's. I hope you smoke cigars. If you don't smoke cigars, then you need to tell me right now, John T. You're getting a flight and you're getting a flight of cigars. Do you smoke cigars, John T? That's where you spun the wheel. You got it. You hit the red. You hit red. And he says yes. So, dude, you hit you hit one of the red ones. Jackpot, baby. So that's it. You get a flight. You get four freaking samples and you get four freaking cigars. That's how we're doing it, baby. So, like I said, Everyone else who super chatted, you're 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 still entered for each amount to the bottle giveaway at the end. Okay, so it was all it's not for nothing. You're still in. This was just tonight's giveaway, and next week we'll do the same thing. The week after we'll do the thing, and then we'll do a bottle giveaway. So, or multiple bottles if this is successful. So if you enjoyed this, you got to spin the wheel. Um, I thought it was cool. <laughs> it was totally random. There's no telling what you were going to get. So, John T., I'll get with you, and we'll we'll figure it out, brother. Um, We're already late, so thank you for joining. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you, Patreons. Thank you for the Super Chats. You're still entered in the giveaway, all of you. I'll ensure that. Post the link to ADHD Whiskey. Let's go over there. You don't know me and you don't know ADHD Whiskey. Go over there. That's where we're going to be. In fact, I, I'm pretty sure i got to keep super tracks, super tracks, super chats for him. So 
Thank you guys. I love you. Until next week. Let's uh let's have a good week, guys. Um see ya. I'll see ya. Let me figure out how to stop this.